After two consecutive wins against Montpellier in the league and Lyon in the French Cup, things were looking up for Marseille. Rudy Garcia's men had closed the gap with fourth place to only four points. They travelled to Metz, who had suffered a disappointing 2-1 loss at Angers. And looking to improve their discipline, they had two men sent off in that match. And it was also the return of Dimitri Payet to his hometown, but no start as of yet for the 13 million euro signing. Straight from kickoff, Marseille looked to put the hosts under pressure. A good solo run by Puna Saar led to nothing. Dumain Didion saving well from the youngster, but Saar clearly showing his side's intentions for the match. Then it was Tourvin's turn to come close to Ford, unable to add to his six goals this season after being played through by Maxime Lopez. Didion once again with a save to keep the score at 0-0. Goalless at half-time, Marseille creating all the chances and very unlucky not to be ahead at the break. Metz creating next to nothing in the opening 45 minutes, but still with a very good chance to get something from the game. On for Bounassar, Dimitri Payet had a chance to put his new club ahead, but his shot flew over the bar. Not able to make an immediate impact. Metz also with a substitution that would prove to be decisive, Uber and Get off for Jan Joufre. Marseille still strive forwards, but luck clearly wasn't on their side. Payet making a nuisance of himself on the wing. His cross intended for Cabela hit Simon Fellet on the leg, and it bounced off the bar. The Metz man clearly relieved that the ball didn't end up in his net. Metz's first significant chance of the game came after 18 minutes. Jouf sending Erding through on goal. His touch wasn't great and Johan Pille was able to make a save. Finally, a chance for Metz. Then Ismail Assar's run provoked the all-important free kick that would lead to the Metz goal. Jouf stepped up. And his free kick worthy of a David Beckham beat Pele at his far post. Metz with a late goal against the run of play. And looking at the replay, Gomis maybe got a slight deflection. The home side even had the opportunity to make it 2-0. But this time, Pele denied Sheikh Javate, who was unable to add to his two goals this year. A frustrating night for Marseille, all round who lose their third Ligue 1 match in their last four, met with an unpredicted win that carries them one spot above the relegation zone. <laughs>